Hi guys and girls on YouTube and welcome to my channel. Just a quick little video here because I know my viewers like to see things that are slightly unusual. Uh, well take a look at this for unusual. It's a Murphy radio. Uh, it's a model scene one A858 and it dates from about, the camera's going to have to focus, it dates from about 1969. Um, it's all transistorized. Now it came in because the dial cord was snapped on FM. Um, there's one cord for FM and one cord for uh, AM. Well, it just so happens I've still got a bit of this left in stock. Anyway, I repaired the fault, but I had to get a service manual to get the um, the actual um, winding of the dial cord. Uh, and I managed to get that from the Radio Museum in Germany. Um, I requested the manual and uh, for a donation. Um, they just um, email it to you. Anyway, it's sorted out now. Um, I thought we'd just take a quick look. Um, now it's actually it's a bit unusual because although it's made by Murphy or it says Murphy on the front it's actually made by Normande um, and that's the uh, the details of it so we'll just see it running and then we'll have a quick look at the back uh, now I don't know how well it shows up on the camera but this top flap is orange uh, and the bottom one's actually red um, and that's it there up and running let's just turn up the volume before, didn't you? But not, not quite all of it. That's on uh, FM. Yeah. Let's try a long wave. That's why I missed the game. I tried to walk from John O'Groats to Lamb. Not many channels left on uh, analog anymore. 300 miles on the West Island Way on Clint Hill. <laughs> but we do have a few more left on FM. I don't actually remember a time now when it wasn't going to include ancient trees as the purpose. Are you sharing it on social media at all? I do have a, a Twitter. It's at Tree Pilgrim. Let's just turn that intrigued. down, and then uh, we'll just. It's actually on a swivel as well. You you can close these flaps, um, and it actually swivels around on its base. You can see that's orange now, and the bottom one's red. Uh, let's just swivel it round camera's going to have to focus again that's better right let's take a look at the back and it's got somebody's sticker on there look from when it was repaired uh, no doubt many many years ago I have had a look on the internet and that company doesn't seem to be in business any longer uh, but that's an interesting part of the history stuck to the back uh, it's actually connected to the outside aerial because I get very poor reception in here been inside but yeah that's quite an unusual and I would imagine a uh, rarish radio right all right guys and girls I thought you'd like to have a look at that I'll catch you in the next video many thanks for watching